we're going to be doing a DIY bike chain. So here is the original. I pretty much like it. So this is our reference. So here's what we'll be needing. So I'll just put this back here next to the tape. We'll be needing a straw, a scissors, two keychains, these types, and some tape. This is really old tape, that's why it looks kind of dirty. Well, not really dirty, but like... So, first, you're gonna wanna put the keychain... You're gonna kinda attach them both together. Don't really know how to say that. Okay, I think I got it. Yeah, I got it. So then you're gonna put this down, and you're gonna put it in that form. Then, you're gonna cut this into six pieces. Oh no! Okay, well, we're just gonna do that inside the tape, since they fling everywhere. One. Two. Let me just grab that. Oh, sorry. Three. Four. We can't cut that part, so we're just gonna put that there. Five. And then the last one, six. So on four of them, we're going to be cutting holes which we're going to grab this and kind of put it on like that. Oh wait, that one's too big. So we're, we're going to cut this. And we're going to kind of put it on like that. Then next, we're going to be doing that for four more. This is really easy. So, and these are also like home supplies that you'll probably have. Why am I putting them like up in the air like that? Sorry. And you're gonna wanna put that there. So kind of like that. It is kind of hard at sometimes, but and it doesn't matter if the shapes are uneven because yeah, it just doesn't matter. It's okay if they're uneven, kind of like mine. Some are fat and short. So then we're gonna get these, which oh, I'm put them. Oh, I like that. Just going to get another straw. Okay, so I fixed mine up. So with, with another straw. <laughs> so with the two oh, up. the two pieces of straw you have left, you're just going to put in the middle of all the straws that you put in the keychain. So they're kind of like connected. And if all of them are connecting together, just kind of pull the keychain apart. I mean, one like that. Kind of in like that. Yeah, kind of bad at organizing this. But then you're gonna get your cello tape. And you're gonna cut some. Yes, you will need four small pieces of tape. And 
also make sure you're not taping the keychain bits because if you tape those then your bike chain will not work this won't look like the official one so if you want it to look like the official one then like oh, this one it won't work so you'll just have to go to another tutorial So there we go. And then the next base. Well, not a space more like. And if you want, you can decorate it more, but I just need to trim this tape. Then we push all that mess away. Sorry guys, mine didn't take properly. Okay, so here's what the final result will look like. Um, mine, I just didn't tape the ends of mine properly. It will be a tiny bit stiff at the start, but then when you start playing it with it, it will get less stiff and easier to use. You can use any color straw. I just decided to use pink, because pink is one of my favorite colors. My favorite color is yellow though. It's just the yellow kind of looked like kind of looked like slime. So I do like lime, but I'd rather pink. So hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching my video. Bye. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Sorry, um, if you see how my phone's shaky every time I like move, it's because you're on. It's like this octopus bendy like phone holder thing, and it's. On, in my lap and it's propped up on my leg. So that's why you see my foot here because I'm sitting across my side of my bed. But today I'm gonna be showing you how to make a DIY bike chain um, video toy. We, but we aren't gonna be using any bike chains. I did not come up with this, but I've seen a couple people do it. And I just thought I would do it on camera. So first you will be needing two key rings which you can get key rings, like this was part of a keychain and this key ring was on it. Or you can like get them like off of your keys. Um, or keychains. These have key rings in them. Or you can also use um, like this other type of key ring where you like pull it open. You can use those too. And the next you're gonna be needing scissors you're gonna be needing um tape like i just have some washi tape but you can use clear tape or any type of tape and next you're needing a straw um a plastic straw because that they're always ones and okay here so first step is your bike chains here let's move all this it's your bike chains um you're gonna not bike chains um what are they key rings you're gonna pull one of them open and slide
just gonna cut your, and I cut a small piece at first. And you're gonna stick it like right on the straws. And try and find the other side of it. So you're just gonna, oh, okay, I need some different tape. You can um, put paper around this. Now your right chain is done. And you can move the lines basically. And go into the next one right now. Basically, just go along the way. And this is how you make a really, it's pretty simple. It's how you make a DIY. So, the videos I've seen, they put paper around it, they didn't put tape, but I think it's a better way to customize it if you put like your own type of like washi tape or cute decorated like duct tape or whatever, I think it's cute. But so yeah, that's how you make a bike chain, you can do it both ways. It's pretty simple to make. And bye guys, and thank you for watching my video, please like and subscribe. be posting my fidget collection next. I don't have a big collection. And I don't have any like music store fidgets. I just have the fidgets that I've had on the house. But thank you for watching how to make a DIY.